Welcome to the DZ Report. You are rocking with your boy. We still here, aren't we? <laughs> we still here, aren't we? Aren't we? Huh? <laughs> now, I just got a question, like for the people. Do you want fame or fortune? Now, I've been hearing that people are telling me about um, an artist out of Memphis, a chick named Glorilla, I think that's her name, Gorilla or Big Glow, they call her. Listen to some of her music. In my opinion, she she's straight, but I like the other chick, K Carbon. K Carbon, the one who's the vicious one. To me, she, you know, Glorilla probably will give you more hits, but K Carbon, dog, when it comes to bars and psh, K Carbon, a trip. <laughs> that chick is vicious on the mic. Now she signed the deal. I saw on the video where she signed the deal, and I don't want anybody to think I'm hating because I I I'm not hating. I just look out for young women and young men, especially when I used to teach them. You know, I still feel for those kids in my hearts. You know that we couldn't get everybody out, but we graduated a lot. Now, here's the problem. There were no lawyers present. There were no man, her manager, nobody was there. It was just her and Yo Gotti. Now, I don't know. Um, I don't know if there were any um, meetings beforehand with the lawyers where the lawyers were like, yo, this is a good deal. You know, you ought to go for this. I didn't see none of that. Now, I don't want to sound like the old fuddy-duddy guy, but we've seen this before with young artists being taken advantage of. You know, and it, it's sad how it happens, but this is something that, you know, we've, we've seen for a long time happen, especially to um, young artists, especially like this one. She had um, uh, a hot track, F and F, you know, which was basically so far the summer anthem. You know, everybody feeling that she had it. She got a song with Duke Deuce or whatever his name is. Just say that. That go hard. You know, so she's a young, you can tell she's from Memphis. <laughs> you can tell she's from the South because she... They they rap sort of like her carbon all them rap sort of like three six, um, Dolph and all of them. Memphis has always had their own style. They've never tried to copy anybody or emulate anybody. They've always had their own style, and that's one reason why I love Memphis music. They never try to take it. Shout out to L Zero B Zero Lobo, I believe is from there. Or he's right up the street. I'm not sure. I got to ask him. But for her to get in, I mean, I, I hope the deal's okay. But I just saw her with the money. The mon They had the monies in the bag. And she that was her advance. She signed a million-dollar contract. And she got an advance of 500000 Well, I hope she understands is that when after her album or whatever she does with um, Yo Gotti, they're gonna come back for that 500,000. All that was was a loan. That 500K was just a loan. That's all it was. You know, and I don't know if she understands that. I hope she does because I don't want her to end up like the rest of these artists and you know. So now, you know, she got her teeth fixed, which I didn't, I didn't believe she needed her teeth fixed. You know, to me, I thought she was fine the way she was. She's a pretty little, she's a pretty little girl now. You know what I'm saying? So, I just hope the young woman, man, had a lawyer look over the contract or get her a lawyer to look over the contract, know what you're going to make, and try not to spend your money. You know, I, I hope she don't spend all her money. You know, because they're going to want that back. On top of that, they're going to probably want interest. Because that's interest. It's, it's mainly like a loan. You know, so. So, you 
you know. man what, what you guys think y'all think I'm overreacting I'm probably overreacting you know if, if you a young buck who listens to her or follow her or anybody watches you know let me know how you feel because um she's a hot young artist man like it's time we get more females in the game rapping I mean rapping real lyrics like she rapping lyrics some sexy as well as gutter lyrics she'll come fight y'all that you know all of that stuff so she's well rounded like i said out of i listen to her but the person that i like the best out of all of them is um k carbon k carbon is nasty with it that's the best one out of all of them whoever if she keep doing her thing i hope she stay independent because if they get her they're gonna try to change her and i don't want her to change because she got that attitude you know and she's dark-skinned so you know how they treat dark-skinned sisters. They don't really give them the love like they give the light-skinned chicks. Not trying to say that's why they pick Glorilla because she's light-skinned. Please, do not go off. Do not go crazy. You know, I'm just saying. You know, sometimes, you know, that happens. But, you know, let me know, man, what you guys think about that. Do y'all think Yo Gotti um, finessed her? I think from the way it looked, I believe he did because they didn't have no lawyers there. They didn't have nobody there. And it's like, why don't you have any lawyers there? Like, why don't you have any people who, you know what I'm saying? Who, who knows what's going on? Like I would have had my lawyer there reading over the contract, making sure everything was done. I would have got the contract, took it to my lawyer to look at, you know, and, and, and then to me, Glorilla really didn't need to sign like, why would you sign? Like, in this day and age, you only need a label or you need somebody when you, um, when you, um, need a distribution deal. Other than that, dog, you can sell your own records because you could do what you got to do. And then once you get a distribution deal, you got the power of your music. That was the whole point that a lot of us learned. I learned this growing up. Because um, my brother and um and our, and our little brother, man, they was both of them, Trife and um, Kano, they was about to sign um, a deal. And I told them, man, don't sign that deal, man. Go take that to a lawyer. You know what I'm saying? And then, hey, it is what it is. But you got to remember, man, like these guys, man, they, they ain't nothing but, they ain't nothing but gatekeepers. God, he's a gatekeeper. You know, so I, I hope he does right by Glow. You know, because I don't want to see her on the where are they and where, you know, what happened and all that stuff. It's like, nah. But, yo, man, don't bring up that stuff about what she said about Young Dolphin and, and um, yo, Gotti. Man, that, that was a long time ago. Y'all trying to bring up some stuff, man, that don't even need to be brought up. But hey, Memphis, Memphis people are different though. They don't care. You supposed to pick a side until the end. And I think there's people in Memphis who really didn't like her signing with Yo Gotti. Because they do not like Yo Gotti. Like there's some people. Not saying the whole city. Just saying that, you know, people who are in the city who cool with half of them. She got like a 50-50 love and hate now because... She chose your guy. So, well, let me know in the comment section what you think about this. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share this. Hit the notification bell to select all to receive upcoming notifications. And if y'all love what y'all hear, man, y'all can um go to my description box, hit that link to the cash app. You guys can donate whatever your hearts desire. You know, thank you guys for listening. We out. Deezy.